today I'm going to show you um, how to make sushi using the Kitchen Boosters Do-It-Yourself Sushi Kit. So everything in black here is included with the kit. Um, the cutting board and the glass bowl and this little bowl are mine, but the rest of it all comes in the kit. So um, you just have to buy a sheet of nori and um, my store actually only had the half sheets. So instead of making the big ones, and with those, you can make um, all these different shapes. You can make um, the round, the heart, the teardrop, the triangle, the half moon, the mouse ears, the square, and the mini square. But I'm gonna show you the mini square because since I only have a half sheet, I can only make the little mini squares. So what you do is you take your nori sheet and you want, there's a rough side and a smooth side. So you wanna have the smooth side down and then I'm going to take the lid and you want to get pretty much in the middle and I'm going to push it down and then I'm going to take some rice right here and I'm going to add it to my dish so it's a little bit easier with the bigger mold to get it in but I can still show you Without making too big of a mess. So just want to get the rice all the way in there and then you want to add um, your flavoring on the inside. So you can add whatever you want. I am just adding cucumber today because that is actually my family's, my kids favorite is just cucumber roll. So that is what I'm going to make them today. And then once that's in, normally you can add sushi, you can or raw meat, crab meat, whatever you want into your sushi. It could even be fruit and you can do other things. But today I am making a cucumber roll. So I think I added too much stuff because well, I need to actually fold the nori over. So you fold the nori over and you're going to wet your finger and smooth it down on here and then you're going to fold over the other nori but since my sheets are too small it's not actually working very well but let's just pretend it did then you get to use the knife that comes with it and oh you're supposed to get the knife slightly damp using the damp towel and then you just cut and each of these slots Oops mist and hole there. Then you put the lid back on, squish it down, and then you flip it over and the lid and 